Welcome to CERT's podcast series on the Secure Coding Initiative. The CERT program is part of the Software Engineering Institute, a federally funded research and development center at Carnegie Mellon University in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. We're talking with Robert Secord, Senior Vulnerability Analyst at the Software Engineering Institute's CERT Coordination Center and author of Secure Coding in C and C++ about training provided through CERT Secure Coding Initiative. The Secure Coding Initiative has spent several years developing guidance about secure coding practices. How are you getting the word out? Well, mainly through publications, training, and education. Our most significant publication to date is the CERT book on secure coding in C and C++. Uh, we've also developed secure coding standards for the C and C++ programming languages that are published on our website. You mentioned education. What are you doing in that area? Well, we've offered an undergraduate course in secure programming at Carnegie Mellon University in the School of Computer Science. And we're also planning to offer a graduate level course in the Department of Electrical and Computer Engineering. Uh, we've also uh, worked with a number of universities, including Columbia University, Penn State, Santa Clara University, and the University of Pittsburgh, that are using the secure coding text uh, in their courses. How about in the corporate environment? Do you have any training for developers who've been coding in C or C++, but who want to know more about how to make their code secure? Well, we have been offering a one-day tutorial in secure coding at conferences and other events over the past two years. Uh, this tutorial describes uh, insecure coding practices, how vulnerabilities resulting from these practices can be exploited, and how to mitigate against these vulnerabilities. So any individual or organization could contact CERT and sign up to take the tutorial? Well, yeah. We're uh, currently collaborating with SANS to offer this training at the upcoming SANS Fire event in Washington, D.C and also the SANS Network Security Event in Las Vegas later in the year. We're also offering shorter courses in secure coding at the Dr. Dobbs uh, SD Best Practices Conference in Boston in September. I know CERT collaborates with other computer emergency response organizations all over the world. Are you sharing the standards material internationally at all? Well, we've been working extensively with our Japanese counterpart, JPCERT, to make the Secure Coding in C++ book available in the Japanese language and to provide secure coding training in Japanese. So you've got quite a variety of secure coding training activities underway already. Any future plans you'd like to tell us about? In addition to our Japanese training, we're developing a longer four to five day SEI course offering and partner organizations interested in providing secure coding training can obtain licensing. Thanks for telling us about the training opportunities. Oh, you're very welcome. Thanks for joining us. To learn more about what we've discussed today, visit the secure coding area at cert.org.